overrushing, but I can't help falling in love. Big ending. With you. I hope they catch you. Are we live? Oh, man. Hey, yeah. everybody. Welcome to Live from Fire and Safety. I'm getting in the Valentine's mood here, boss. Hey. I, I want to tell everybody officially, Yep. congratulations, Grandpa. Thank you. Also, congratulations to Adam and Heather Har Harbert on the, uh, let's tell us a little bit about the oh. uh, the new bundle yeah. of joy uh, in the life. We were opposed to, or when I say we, you know, I kind of think I got caught up in this thing, but anyway. Well, I am. I'm, I mean, I'm the pop. Huh? But anyway. Uh, Is that what he's going to call you? Well, I'm going to answer to whatever he calls me. But I, they're I am pop, going pop. to. And, and I'm good with that. But whatever comes out of my mouth is what I'm going to answer. I to. am going. Me and Dooner talked well, yesterday. I'm to and I, I, Heather, if you're watching, we have got to coerce baby Eli into calling him. Ready, Dooner? You ready? Captain. <laughs> Captain Pop. <laughs> Captain Pop. Uh, but anyway, they were supposed to induce her this Sunday, and uh, last Thursday she called, and um, it was like, well, hey, it's time to go and introduce the label. And he, he came in on uh, Friday morning about one thirty-two in the morning, on one thirty-one, and he's healthy and everything's good. Mom and Dad's home doing great. And well, that's good. Now we're just waiting on him to grow up. Well, without a doubt, we're glad to see he's healthy. Uh, I know you guys have, are really excited about that. We are. But uh, now we just got to get Hulk something like that. Lord help us all. And uh, so Bryson, if on. you're watching, we still uh, we still praying for you. Yep. Chris Rooney, what's up, Chris? Sorry about your loss last week, brother. We love you. Uh, Dwayne, Dwayne was just here. Where'd he go? Uh, uh, Miss Una, the parking lot. it was so nice. I met Miss Una Yates. A few weeks ago, what a sweet lady, sweet soul down in Gray Court. Mm -hmm. And uh, hey, listen, if if you guys are in racing ram, if especially four cylinders, if you ain't got a JRE racing engine, you're missing out. Well, there I'm you go, out, Miss. You don't know nothing about racing. So well, on the 500 comes my, on. My homeboy from Sunday. another mother, my brother from another mother, Jason Smith and Tim. They down there. They they get it going on. Jason Blanton, what's going on? Hey, my beautiful wife is watching. Uh, it's probably Brindley or Rhett. So, what's up, guys? Um, hey, Scott Covert, hey, hello, sir. Boss, great time of year. Yeah, but hold on just a second. Okay. Why, why are we doing this? Guys, I told everybody last week, we changed something on the set. Now, it's not the pink tablecloth or the roses or the berry. It has nothing to do with this right here. First person, tell me. Thank you. Now, First you person that can tell me. What's different can, I can't see that, but first person that does is going to win a special prize today. So tell well, me what it is. Ashley Plaxico yep. says hello. Yeah, Ashley. But it's not the sign. That was last week. Oh, man. King, my stranger. What's going on, Kevin? Good morning, Ashley. Uh, Miss Una, it is not the banners. It is not the banner. Oh, Kenzie Carter has nailed it, boss. No. Kenzie Carter. Kenzie Carter. Uh, yeah, she, where, where at? Let me see. There is a four on the fire hat. Go Kenzie girl. Carter, you have won yourself a prize. Yeah. Uh, Mitchell McGahy, good morning. Um, Brian O. Uh, Amy, you're a little late, sweetheart. Four on the helmet. Uh, they will be something next week. They will be uh, something next week. Amy, I don't have no control over this. Uh, Who's this idea is, was that? This is captain's idea hey and while we're on the point hey congratulations 29th year as captain of the star fire department Thank that's you. uh it must be nice to finish third every year well hey I mean, with, a, with, a, with a group of guys like it's down hey, there, i agree down there third, great third great honor, leadership i'm telling you right now a bunch of great guys down there growing and, up uh, uh growing up in the assistant department uh you always kind of idolize star and what they had for the years down there great leadership i know it means a lot to, we take to, pride in it, and, I, to and be they down take there. pride in it, and it's uh, and I, well, myself, and it's it's a special place. It is. It's a special. Well, place. it's it's it stands alone. You the know, second, when you're talking about um, 29 years as a leadership role, man, that's huge, and uh, that that is pretty uh, pretty awesome to see. Thank you, um, Kevin King. Man, I I got to get up with you, brother. It's been a while since we talked and seen each other, but I hope you're doing well. 
Well, boss, let's, let's, let's dive right into this thing. Today was today. going to be our second segment of Meet the Employees, but uh, we had planned on Jeff coming. Unfortunately, I don't know if you didn't send him the email or what, but Jeff is actually working. Yeah. Um, well, so, he'll be on next week. Yeah, but we'll get he's him not, on next he's week. Not, he's not dodging us. But let's talk about some of the product line today. Yeah. Um, this is kind of in your wheelhouse. I like it. Um, uh, you love the Bullard helmet. I do. Um, I wear one. Uh, they are comfortable. They are. Uh, great uh, product. And one of the things I like is they got the uh, Bullard Cares. And mm -hmm. we'll talk about, a little bit about it. But talk to us what we got here today. Really, really, guys, what I really like. Um, Bullard, of course, they come in the, the matte finish or the shiny finish just like other competitors does. Um, Bullard. A lot of people, when they when they grab a bullet, they go, oh, that's heavy. But do you know any manufacturer in a helmet, they all within an ounce or two ounces from each other as far as weight, okay? Now, I hadn't actually put this in on the scale beside a competitor's, but, you know, they're the same. I wear them. What I like about Bullard is the leather that they have inside here. The so ratchet padding. The ratchet okay. padding is leather. I don't know if they can see. But um, this is standard. It comes standard with an engraved eagle. So some people, you know, you don't. That's all extra. But on a bullet helmet, all this is standard. Um, and you can get it with the shield or the NFPA Borks. But one thing they and that do. That particular one, our good friends at Cold Springs Fire Department. Jay, yeah, let us borrow that. Jay, I made the mistake and put an S at the end of Springs. So uh, <laughs> I'm just waiting on your new front. should be here any day. Right. Um, another another great thing they got, and we, we sell a lot of these right here, and a lot of departments in Anderson County's got them, is the same helmet, but it comes with what they call the track light. Correct. And, of course, everybody knows you put some of the helmets we got. We got flashlights off the side. But on the, the Bullard, is that right? I mean, that's Runs right. off. It's got eight LED lights right here, heat-resistant lens right here. It's mounted onto the helmet. It does come down over top of it. It's got a blue tracking light at the bottom of it, so you can kind of see. Oh, yeah. You know, how you like that? It's pretty neat. I mean, it's somebody like yourself that's been a right. captain for 29 years, it's going to okay. be easy to keep up with you. So, anyway, it turns off and on real easy. It takes four AA, AAA batteries. Triple A's, I believe, yeah. yes. And it's that word that I can't say. say you want to try to pronounce that? I can't. I'm not even going to butcher that uh, word. I've been trying to practice um, it this morning. And I it makes it, it non-conductive. How about that? Yeah, but there's a word for yeah, it. Yeah, I can't say Come on. it. No. Okay. No. I, I don't either. even know how to spell it. I can't either. But anyway, this is what they call the USTM for matte finish. Correct. But they do make a uh, traditional style, which we call turtle shells. Um, they also make it in the uh, thermal plastic or the fiberglass. And thermal glass, is that me? Uh, I'm not even going to answer that. <laughs> but, but anyway, this in here just has our barrier up in here, and it kind of keeps a lot of the heat off of, of the fireman, and it makes it a lot more comfortable with all the little and all that. So. Now, one of the things that's impressive with this, and, and you know, there's – multiple fire helmets that have it mm -hmm. the the retract system uh, on one of these if you got glasses um oh yeah I and stuff look, yeah. uh you talking about a single hand source you don't have to grab it from both ends and pull down and you know one that's, of the things i the love about this the competitors is right. called the defender series as a so. beautiful chubby face sometimes the other ones don't Go ahead fit and your light on too right so uh i really enjoy Look how easy that was. Did you check that door for heat, Timmy? So, uh, so anyway, uh, huh. hey, my, my, my sister there, um, Jade, what's up, Jade? Dale Millwood, or and he, on Facebook, he's Mill Dog. Gotcha. He's my dog. He's old school. Uh, Philip Brooks. Scott, you're, you're a day late and a dollar short, my friend. Um, it was the four in the helmet. Imagine that. I don't know why Russ did that. Uh, Billy Jones, good morning. Uh, Pretty cool. Well, one. we appreciate it. The reason we do so much for fire services is because we're firemen and we just love. Yeah. Myself, I owe my life to fire service because it kept me out of a lot of stupid things. And uh, I'm fortunate enough to say that the fire department kept me out of the penitentiary and the graveyard. Yeah. 
So uh, yeah, for do. that, I will always owe the fire system something. Um, Jacob Brock. Uh, yeah, Eric Lutz. Oh, man, Eric Lutz. Brad, oh, Brad Barker, our brother Bar Brad, oh, Brad Barker. Good to see you, buddy. Um, listen. Come see me. Post had lunch about, I don't know, three months ago. Well, if, come see me. If, you, if you're coming up here, don't forget the, the keto guy, you know what I mean? So, look, boss, it's Valentine's Day. But you you, you and Crystal? Was you done? I might not have been done. Okay, I'm sorry. You so, did. anyway, guys, call us anything you want to know about the Bullard Firefighting Helmet. Um, I want you to order one of them cool helmets we looked oh, at yeah. today. We're going to have on it. Hopefully, we can get in touch with our bullet rep and uh, maybe get him on the show. With Absolutely. Us the Absolutely. Show there. But I just kind of wanted to go over that. You know, we do sell Carnes helmets. We do sell bullet helmets. So uh, we have you take your choice, take your pick. And, and each one of them has Dooner, cool, have that, cool features. But the track helmet. light right now is real good. And uh, we sell a lot of them. So. And just FYI, guys, uh, we are going back and making some collegiate mm -hmm. helmets. Um, this is a product we've offered kind of ourselves here for a while. If you have that sporting team and you want to look at getting to it, give me or us a call. We'll definitely get you. This one here is a North Carolina one. I'm not sure who ordered it. I mean, they beat the Gamecocks, Actually, so, you yeah. know. But Actually, I think we just made that because we had a sticker kit. Yeah, a blue helmet I'm, I'm not sure. But it's really but I, cool for tailgating yeah, and stuff like I've that. I've made some helmets for Atlanta Falcons. I've made the Miami Dolphins, Miami Hurricanes, Clemson, South Carolina, of course, Georgia. And actually, uh, a couple of people that's in the NFL. Oh. I've made, uh, it used to play with Georgia. Has oh. got a couple of our Georgia helmets. So, it's not pretty neat. Uh, so do you and Crystal give each other anything for Valentine's Day? Not really, because I tell her I love her every day, so I really don't need to pick a day just to tell her that I love her. She knows I love her. Well, I love her, too. Uh, but if you guys swap out gifts. Right. And you no, gotta we don't. I'm not, at, I'm, not, I'm just saying if you did. Listen to what the conversation but is. Sometimes don't. I feel like we're married. But we don't. I mean, if you did... Okay. okay. Yep. Yeah, Suppose well, if you all, were you're not in, gonna give her no ideas. I mean, what I'm saying is, well, she wouldn't buy you nothing anyway. She but if you about. have a, a loved one that you want to express that for, um, and they're a firefighter uh, or uh, um, they do something outdoors, let's talk about some of the products. Bullard Helmet is one of those products. Bullard not only makes for firefighting. They also make safety wear for you. If you got that construction worker, uh, we got hard hats. Um, wildland firefighter. Wildland firefighter helmets is a really nice product. It's really is. comfortable. Our good friends at South Union just bought a, a mm -hmm. big group of them. And really and truly, Bullard offers a lot. But one of the things I'm most impressive with with Bullard is it's called the Bullard Cares. And it comes with a mesh bag and you ratchet uh, material padding, and they want you to wash it. And, and that's pretty neat. And uh, Bullard, thank you guys for for doing that for the fire service. As somebody who's battled cancer, it's pretty impressive to see companies trying to get up on that platform. I like it. But let's talk about some other gifts. Okay. Our good friends at Youngstown Gloves. If you ain't got one of these gloves, I even seen a hog hunting video this past week where my boy Hulk had a pair on. That's impressive. It was. Youngstown Glove can go from any situation, but if you guys are not yep. wearing Youngstown tight necks tees, you're missing out. Good glove. You're, you're missing glove. out. And thank y'all um, guys again. But don't forget our, our stream light. And I had, oh, here it is here. Hey, we have a biggest. Snuck him in here. What? I just noticed Freddie in the. In the, Fr in the Freddie Bear, the legend himself, Freddie Bear. He's Casanova, man. Just let him do his thing. All right. It comes to a point in the show when it's time to give away some stuff. And since you're buying and I'm giving away, yeah. that's my favorite thing Let's to do. do Let's do it. Let's so, do it. We're so gonna what give are we away giving first? away first? All right. We got a $50 gift card. Okay. okay. And it's to one of the multiple restaurants. I think Bonefish Grill, uh, Olive Garden, Longhorns, um, so on and so forth. But uh, let's give away one of them first. And here we go. The spin. If y'all can see that. Spinning to winning. The winner is a 
Everett Walker. Everett Walker. Everett Walker. From Lawrence County. Lawrence County. He actually lives in Easley, too. Everett, congratulations. You have won yourself a $50 gift card. Be sure to take that wonderful wife out. And he is married, by the way. Yeah. And, uh, exactly. listen, uh, we, we're going to be give giving away, away his, another ne- next week, though. But you know what? Because I love these people out here. Yeah. Let's give away the most comfortable glove on the market. Okay. Let's give, let's give away a pair of Youngstown Titan XTs. And that winner belongs to David Gleason. David Gleason. David Gleason. David, I will tag you. Um, man, you're going to love these gloves. Yep. I guarantee it. Boss, yep. we're moving into uh, the day. Yep. What are some of the tricks being made for 30 years for somebody out Ooh. there? So you're- I don't want to, it's but the, it's not a trick. producer asked me to. It's not a, it's not a trick. It's just uh, oh, no, it's a trick. communications. Sometimes you do what you don't want to do because your other half does the same thing. Trust me. They might not want to do everything you want to do. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to say? No. Yeah. Okay. But anyway. No. I have established. Thank you. Women get it. I, I have mean, established in my, my. Hang my, on. I'm talking. Oh, okay. And you're just trying to overspeak me. No, I'm just now, trying to help my brothers said, out. I am too. Tell her you love her every night. Don't go to bed mad. And sometimes it's give and take. You know, don't be trying to take all of it. You got to kind of meet them in the middle. <laughs> I'd like to Marriage see the tip. day. 101. From the, all right, there you have it, folks. Hey, Marriage can, tip I, I, from I, the I'm not finished. captain. <laughs> <laughs> I can save you fire equipment. I can take you hunting. I can dip out on you. Yeah, well, I just one of the things that I've been most impressed with I'm not with finished. my significant other, I wasn't other finished. is. I know, but I really wasn't fishing. But, let's t- but let's I'm very blessed to be married to such a wonderful person for 30 years. Well, listen, this woman right here is amazing. I've known Crystal as long as I've known you. you. Um, and to put up with you for that long is uh, absolutely amazing. And, uh, you know, I call her, you know, Ma myself. Yeah. Uh, Raised two wonderful kids without you being there, Captain. And uh, Crystal, my heart goes out for you, babe. And we if need to get her on the show. Her we, need to, we need to her get her on the show. Her and Amy needs to come on to the show. Well, I was going to tell you one of the tips from me. Because Amy, let me tell you. That's Amy's a fireball. A lady, she's my fireball. She's a nice girl. Oh, I love her today, man. You, you know, she's uh, beautiful. She's uh, amazing. But one of the things that I found out was, and you, you might can consider this. You said, baby, what's wrong? <laughs> Nothing. I said, now, are, are you mad? Oh, boss, she mad. Oh, yeah, you can tell. And me and you have been in a, some tight quarters and her having to deal with my insurance, and you've seen how mad she can be. Oh, I don't. Amy, I love you. Don't be mad. She's a trooper now. But if, if, if you're out there and you're freshly married and she says she's mad, oh, she mad. She mad. She mad. And usually when they, you ask them something, they go, mm hmm. Oh, she mad. That, yeah. That's nah. really a no. That means you need so to. you got to be able to understand. That means you a, need to take mm-hmm. yourself to Dollar General. Yeah. And get you one of these. Because <laughs> one of these is like a yeah. get out of jail free card. And it says, some I'm, of these ink pens. Are yeah. these ink pens? I don't know. I think it's cho- uh. chocolate. But nah. I've had enough of that. Well, Let's move on. Okay. Come on. We gotta get well, this, this about line. wraps up the show, yeah, guys. But listen. Hey, remember about, hey. The rain, the weather. Oh, boy. Hey, it's coming. Meteorologist David Nichols has been filling us Ooh, in. Uh, hey. David yeah, is. You uh, want to know what the weather is, call our buddy David because uh, David, go we out love and buy you. a boat and take yeah. life jackets. Well, and, if uh, I had a skill saw. A helicopter. And, <laughs> uh, I, we can't say it on that, but I love the story about the cork. Uh, he caught me off guard. Hey, if you want to know <laughs> more about the cork, be sure to call me around. Yeah, uh, you will love it. I guarantee you. Uh, but uh, now, listen, some few shout outs, guys. Um, listen, Chris Burton, David Gleason. Hey, man, congratulations. You won. Uh, I'll get try to get in touch with you. Uh, let's see. Miss Yuna said, don't be cheap. Hey, Van and Mary in Tennessee. Uh, a Van and Mary. Uh, Van. Always watches. Listen, thank you guys so much for watching. Van, I, I hope everything is going well for for you, brother. You've been in my prayers. But he and, loves, he, they always compliment on what. Well, that's because, you know, y'all have known each other longer, but Mary and Van knows what's up. 
Okay, they know the six foot seven. Okay, about ready to get on that. Goddess of a man here, sir. But listen, guys, we really hope you have a Valentine's Day. Be sure to thumbs up button. Be sure you hit the share button because we got another gift card to give away. Next and there'll week. be something different on the set too. And what do you think? Let's give away some roses next week. Okay. We'll give away a couple dozen roses. It's on Russ's dime, so let's give it up and let's have a good time. Until next week, say your prayers. Thank you, Lord, for my EMS and firefighters all over this world. Thank you, guys, our soldiers abroad and near. Thank you, guys, from the bottom of my heart. Boston next week. God bless. We'll see you.